He says a family did an online background check on a Muslim man in the UK because he wants to marry their daughter. It was to check if he had any criminal background. It was done by a non-Muslim service by looking at the person's emails, online records, if they had <laughs> any criminal record convictions or any uh, known violent past. Was this kufr as assisted by non-Muslim on a Muslim? The answer is no, this is not kufr by no means because the assistance of the disbelievers against the Muslims has a different of interpretation among the scholars. And the most authentic is when this assistance and giving them backup militarily and uh, uh, mentally and physically and all sorts of backing up is coming from a full-fledged hypocrite who hates Islam, wants the prevailing and the victory of non-Muslims over the Muslims, not on a specific group of Muslims, rather on the entire Muslim Ummah and Islam. This is something that nullifies Islam. As for your case, <coughs> Ahmed, if this private investigator or this service is looking at what is available in the market, such as checking with the police records to see if there are any uh, past convictions, criminal records, etc. This is totally permissible. But to spy on that individual or to track his movement or to monitor or to hack into his emails and messages, this is totally haram and it is spying.